On February 2nd, 2024, on our first sea day after leaving Cape Town, South Africa, the Cunard Queen Mary II insight lecturer for the day was Zelda Lagrange. At the time, we did not know who she was beyond a small blurb in the daily program, which said she was a personal assistant to Nelson Mandela, worked closely with him for 19 years, and that she wrote a best-selling book. We thought it would be interesting to listen to her speak, but we never thought we would be moved to tears listening to her story of her relationship with Mr. Mandela. She took us through the beginning of her journey as a very young African female who was eager to find a job. Growing up supporting the rules of segregation, she spoke of the emotional, life-changing events of working with Mr. Mandela and how it had her questioning everything she was taught. Throughout her career, Zelda proved to be a valuable assistant to Mr. Mandela, and when he retired, he chose her to remain working for him outside of office, which she did until his passing in December of 2013. In 2014, Zelda published her international best-selling memoir, Good Morning, Mr. Mandela, A Young Woman, A President, A Life-Changing Friendship. And this is a perfect title for what she described in her lecture. We were very fortunate to have heard Zelda speak and it touched us both immensely. We were very much looking forward to reading her memoir. Today, Zelda tours the world as a motivational speaker spreading the valuable lessons taught to her by Nelson Mandela. And in her words, the most powerful statesman and humanitarian of our time. She describes the many years of working with him, but more importantly, of how his friendship changed her life. First of all, thank you so much for your great talk yesterday. I know everybody was uh, very moved by it, very, very moved. Thank you, Hannah. Good morning, everyone, and welcome back for more fun. <laughs> For just about an hour, Zelda answered questions with heartfelt honesty, humility, and a bit of humor. The first questions were submitted in advance, and Amanda, our cruise director, asked those. Then the floor was opened up to the audience. At a privacy of those in attendance, we will not disclose exactly what was said, but there was an overwhelming tone to the questions asked. Many spoke of the same feelings of enlightenment and gratitude as we did. In addition, one guest mentioned that she, as were we, choked up with tears after listening to Zelda speak on the previous day. And then there were those citizens of South Africa in attendance who were directly impacted by what Nelson Mandela did, who also spoke. Zelda answered every question with truthful, touching, and encouraging words. And then the last speaker was Michael. Let's listen. This man is, this gentleman is very serious. He's got a night, a night pad. Thank you so much. And thank you for taking that question. They've been raising their hand for so long. <laughs> We are so fortunate to hear you speak. You are an amazing figure for South Africa. Have you ever thought about running for office? <laughs> you are amazing. Thank you, sir. <clears throat> you know, I, I've learned in life, never say never. <laughs> but never. <laughs> This line is the bu book buying, yes, and, that's the and book that signing. line over there is the book signing, and it is packed. It's packed. She did such an amazing job. She's an amazing speaker, and, and she has a tremendous amount of history in her head. Unbelievable. The lines are, lines are all the way out back. She's here signing. Her book has been completely sold out on the ship. Zelda, I got good news and I got bad news. Okay. <laughs> and what do you want first? The bad news. The bad news is you're, I'm going to ask you to sign the program on my belly <laughs> because your book has been sold out on the entire ship. The entire <laughs> ship has been sold out. Excuse me, I've not been to the country. Oh. Maybe 40 will buy. We're, we're signing this, and then what we're going to do is we're going to buy the book online, and we're going to put this in the book. There must not have been a dry eye in the theater yesterday. Yes. You had, you had, if you just go right here in the front. Because we, uh, we were just so moved by that. All right, can I get All a right. picture? Yes. yes.